this is cars all the time search engine and we're always shooting video at car events car collectors and we have a car collector here and your name is ben and we have a few cars to show you and we're going to start off what car we're going to start off with uh this is an aerial atom and tell us a little bit about this car um, well, it's, uh, again, made by a company called Ariel, and the model is Adam. They've been around for uh, nearly a decade now making these. Um, they're made in London, and they've been through a few different iterations. This is called an Adam II. This was imported by Bramo uh, back in 2006. It's powered by a GM Ecotech, which is the same motor that actually used to power uh, the Sunfires and or, uh, the Sunbirds and whatnot. Uh, it's got a supercharger on it made by a company called Harup. Uh, makes right at 300 horsepower at the wheel. Um, as you can tell, it's very light. It's an exoskeleton design. And um, now, the exoskeleton to a lot of people that don't know what the word means, that means it just doesn't really have a body, right? Correct. It doesn't have a body, and the entire the entire frame is this structure, the top and bottom tube that goes all the way around the perimeter of the car. So that so that actually is the frame. And that, that is a really light car. I tell you, light, 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 and. Uh, I'm sure it'll be really fast, right? Uh, they are. They're 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 quick. The uh, they're limited on their top speed mainly because of aerodynamics. Um, t t I've heard someone say that they're about as aerodynamic as a cheese grater, which is probably true. Um, this same car, if if you could put bodywork on it, would easily be 10 to 15 miles an hour faster. Um, but they're not about being fast. They're 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 about being quick. And it's it's really neat to be able to drive this thing to a racetrack, drive it around the racetrack, and be one of the quicker cars there all day, and then turn around and drive it home exactly now what you see right here is this correct Ben this is carbon fiber yes that's carbon fiber as you see it you can see the threads all in here the weave the carbon and they're on top uh, the the car here is also carbon fiber also as you see and a lot of your sports cars do have carbon fiber yes carbon fiber is a uh, uh, you know something that's come about in recent years it's it's light it's strong um, the cost is coming down so we're seeing a lot of carbon fiber production in, in a lot of production cars today